Okay, we are back, and we have a caller. Good morning. You're on the air. Yes, this is Sammy Ford. Hey, Sammy. How are you doing, sir? I'm doing great. How about you? Well, wonderful. Thank you so much for calling in on this beautiful Friday morning. Uh, tell us a little bit about your company and your background, Sammy. Okay. Well, we're a uh, multifaceted auction company located in southeast Kentucky. We have uh, three offices in the little town of Mount Vernon, Kentucky, of London, Kentucky, and Somerset, Kentucky. We're a family business. Uh, there's different family members in each office, and uh, we've been doing this uh, since 1965. We've been in the auction business since 1965, and uh, we've done approximately 6,000 auctions in that time. We do about 150 auctions a year, and uh, uh, we are the, the primary thrust of our business is real estate, but we do everything else too, the whole gamut. Well, well, excellent. Uh, uh, are you, it says Ford Brothers, so it's it's uh, brothers or family business, a lot of... Well, it's, it, now it's brothers, and uh, I have a son involved in the business okay. and a nephew involved in the business, and then uh, we have some other relatives, uh, cousins and so forth, so it, it's, you know, we've got several family members, but... Uh, but then we have a lot of other folks, too, and uh, they're a very important part of our company. Of course. Uh, I was uh, just listening. Uh, Hannes Combest, uh, the NAA executive director, had called in previously and right. was talking about uh, the need to get uh, new blood into the business. So so it's wonderful that uh, you've got a son uh, up and coming. Yeah. Yeah, they're, uh, they've been involved in it. My son is about 10, I guess, well, probably no longer than that now, probably 15 years and my uh, nephew has uh, uh, been involved in it probably 10 and so my brother and I were the, were the principals and we're kind of I guess looking to uh, uh, you know change the range over to them here one of these days not not ready yet uh, oh I understand I understand yeah. perfectly how have you seen the the auction business uh, uh, grow and also change during during your tenure in in regards to uh, uh, the auction business well it, we've seen lots of changes uh, I guess the uh, the major changes are the technological advances that have been made in the auction business uh, you know when I first started we'd go out and do the auction we had a PA system and a and a clerk, and mm -hmm. uh, who was writing everything down, and uh, and, and um, uh, we used to have, we had an old fashioned mailing list that we used we <laughs> by hand, and uh, and so uh, the, from that standpoint, and we, since the age of the computer, you know, now everything we do all of our clerking uh, by computer, we do our mailing list by computer, uh, uh, we do our well, we do phone calls by computer, uh, and. Uh, and now we're selling your property uh, both on site and online, uh, utilizing you know the internet. Um, it just been re just been phenomenal uh, changes uh, and advancements in this in this business. Uh, still not to take away from the old fashioned uh, spirited live bidding auction, uh, but we, you can have a spirited live bidding internet auction as well. And so and we've been uh, taking advantage of that. To, uh, too. Well, very, very true. Um, again, it, it's very exciting to be at big auction and a lot of people bidding and and the thrill of victory when you when you win that bid. Um, again, exciting. But just as you said on the internet, uh, it, it kind of takes um, a little less effort to get involved, and, and therefore you don't have to drive to the site and you don't have to. Uh, Maybe stay overnight. Uh, uh, maybe the costs are, are are a little less, and the time factor is a little less. So it's, uh, um, you know, some, some, sometimes the the seller makes that decision for us. I mean, we can uh, certainly tell them what what we can suggest and what their options are. But uh, you know, I've been surprised before when someone says, "No, I want to." A live auction, and and I've been surprised when a bank says, "No, I want an online auction." It, it 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 just blows my mind. <laughs> my, my nephew recently, just a quick story. Yeah. My nephew recently uh, went out to see a lady, eighty something years old. Right. Of course, he was sure that she wanted to sell this little house and lot that she had by uh, an online, uh, or excuse me, an, 
an on-site right. auction. Right. Well, but I guess what? She didn't. She wanted to do it online, <laughs> and uh, and we and we did it on did the auction online, and uh, and actually it brought uh, a little more than than we'd anticipated, and then that that we told her. But uh, I, I'm you know I'm on the. Uh, I guess in the, in the, the declining years of the profession, I uh, I'll be 65 years old soon, and uh, I have, I was the, one of the holdouts with these younger guys coming on, these young and uh, uh, of, of, of changing over, mm-hmm. uh, and uh, but. Now that I have seen the change and what can transpire. Uh, I'm sure glad that uh, they won me over, you know, uh, because you can have the best of both worlds with uh, doing the live and the Internet auctions as well. Agree, agree completely. You are a member of MarkNet Alliance. Tell us a little bit about uh, them and, and why did you get involved? Well, i got to be honest with you again. I uh, I was reluctant. Uh, I, my opinion was, why do we need anybody like that? You know, right. I've always, I've had, we've had several different uh, chain organizations uh, approach us and want us to affiliate. Uh, but th- the thing I liked about MarkNet, and by the way, my son and my nephew were the r- really responsible for that. Mm-hmm. Uh, they saw it as an opportunity for us to be on the cutting edge, uh, for us to be a, a step ahead of our competition by utilizing uh, the, the, MarkNet, uh, uh, the, the MarkNet technology and the support that we would get. And not only that, we years building your business and your name recognition and with MarkNet you don't lose that you get to keep that and so again it was the best of, of both worlds and it's been a it's been a nice marriage for us well I, uh, I recently went on the on the MarkNet uh, website and and number one I'm, I'm very pleased that they have our show on the website and and mm-hmm. that's always good and again we're we're trying to be an educational uh, experience for listeners in a promotional format for auctions across the country. But also, they've got an, an unbelievable number of auctions going on right now. And, and it, uh, do you know the number? I mean, it's, it, 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 of course, fluctuates, but I've seen it from 300 to over a thousand auctions at, at one given time. Yeah, and I don't know, I couldn't tell you today, uh, but I think, uh, there, one time, a couple of weeks ago, I was checking, and it seemed like there was nearly a 1,000 auctions going at that time. It, it, it's very incredible. So it's apparently a go-to uh, website for people who are looking for, for auctions, investors, and, and that's Absolutely. always good for not only MarkNet, but everybody that's involved. So it's a, It's a win-win situation for everyone, I think. Well, uh, I think so, too. Sammy, uh, if people want to find out about your auctions, uh, what's happening in your area, how do they find out, what's your website, a telephone number, that kind of stuff? Okay. Our our website is uh, www.fordbrothersinc.com, and uh, that will get you to our website, and then uh, push auctions, and uh, it'll tell you what we – the auctions that we have going, you can all check our personnel or back. There'll be a bio on each of our auctioneers and so forth. And uh, our telephone number is one eight hundred four three five fifty four fifty four, 5454 which is a pretty easy number to remember. Well, yes, it is. And, and to tell you the truth, you, you always know that... Uh, um, you, you're dealing with an auction firm that's been around for a while and they've got an 800 number, right? Well, that, yes, that's true. We've had that for many, many years. And, uh, you know, we're in a, uh, in southeast Kentucky. We felt like, we you know, we need to do some things to stay a step ahead and to reach out and get. And so it's been a, it's been a good tool for us, 800 number. Well, um, it definitely is. And, and, Sammy, you were past president of the NAA, the National Auctioneers Association, and, I recognize that as a as a very big uh, endeavor on your part, and, and thank you for the growth of auction businesses across the country. Sammy, thank you so much for being with us this Friday uh, morning, and you have a great weekend. Well, thank you for having me. You bet. Good day. Bye-bye.